When a person is dying, Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said the angels will be speaking amongst themselves, few angels, and the dying person will be listening to the conversation. One person will say, well, he used to go to masjid on a regular basis. He used to fast on the 10th day of Muharram, regular basis, 9th and 10th days of Muharram. And his, these good, good actions are well known, the other angel says. So the, he's listening to these conversations. That time the angel of death comes and introduces himself and then takes his soul away. Right? And the person, uh, the angel said, don't you fear the fear of going to the unknown and to the unseen, the grave. And the grief of leaving the family members behind. The angel said, don't you fear, don't you grieve. We were your friends in this world, even though you didn't see at that time. Now we are going to accompany you in your journey to the life of the hereafter. And once you reach the life of the hereafter, وَلَكُمْ فِيهَا مَا تَشْتَهِي أَنفُسُكُمْ وَلَكُمْ فِيهَا مَا تَدَّعُونَ نُزُلًا مِّنْ غَفُورِ الرَّحِيمِ there you will get whatever your heart's desire. Allah says this in the Quran in paradise. You will get whatever your heart's desire, whatever you wish for, and whatever your heart's desire, you will get it. In other words, there is no questioning in paradise. I, I want this thing, I want that, I would like to have that. You just heart's desire, you wish, and it's presented to you, Allah. What a life, respected listeners. Everlasting life of the hereafter at stake.